Hi guys, this is Alex here to empower your inner video creator. In this video, we're going to show you what we were supposed to show you a couple of weeks ago, which is how to shoot in low light. So why would you want to shoot in low light? If you need to shoot in a dark setting or at night, you need to know the necessary and right camera settings so your shot is perfect. So if you want to do a drama or a horror film like we did a couple of weeks ago, and you can watch over here, you will know how to do it. So let's get started. So for the camera that we used, we got the A7S II. This Sony camera is super good in low light. It goes up until around half a million for ISO. The ISO is the sensibility of the sensor from your camera. So the higher that you go, the more light that you will catch in your shot. But be careful because it will also create more grain in your shots. We're also using a fast lens, which means that it will allow us to go as low as 1.4 in our f-stop. The f-stop or aperture is how wide the iris of the lens opens up. So the lower the number, the more light that it will get into your shot. For your shutter speed, as a rule, you want to double your frame rate. So if you're shooting at 23.97, your shutter speed should be minimum 50. Try to not go below that because then your footage will lose the sharpness. For your lighting, the easiest thing to do is to find whatever light is available. In our case, we use the street lights, which are perfect for this horror film scenario because they are a spotlight right directly above our heads. This create really hard shadows in our faces, which make it distorted. Similar to the street lights, the headlamps create really strong shadows from right above him. Oh, baby! Hi! Hi! Hi, cutie! Hi! Similar to the street lights, the headlamps also work to distort our faces, creating really hard shadows and also making it really high contrast inside the shot. We can also use the headlamps to backlight some other people or create really nice lens flares. Use a tissue if you want to soften your light to not get really strong shadows. Thank you so much guys for watching. I hope you find helpful these tips and tricks on how to shoot in low light. Please subscribe and like this video if you haven't already. We're here every week making filmmaking tutorials just for you. So we'll see you next time. Bye.